1985, the Brisbane Bullets were Australia's national basketball champions. Now in 86, the Brisbane champions are aiming to make it two in a row. It's a 26 point win to the Brisbane Bullets. And the fans, the loyal fans here at Chandler, are just absolutely bathing in glory. The Brisbane Bullets, breaking new records and creating an identity as Brisbane's own National Basketball League champions. Watch the Logans. Yes! Dear, oh dear. What a dunk. The Brisbane Bullets. Ten of the most dynamic basketball players in Australia. Larry Sengstock, captain. 26 years of age, 198 centimetres, 96 kilos. A physical education teacher. His credits speak for themselves. Dual Olympian, 1980 Moscow and Los Angeles, 84. Year in and year out, Larry is one of the leading rebounders in the NBL. Ranked at 10 in the all-time NBL scorers list, Larry is currently Australia's vice-captain. Five years with the Brisbane Bullets and a major strength in the key way. Setstock, oh, look at that aggression on the boards. Larry Setstock with 12 points has done his job tonight. Calvin Bruton, 31 years of age, 176 centimetres, 73 kilos. Brisbane's director of coaching, third year with the Bullets. Cal has a solid gold reputation as one of NBL's finest players. It voted All-Star 5 in 1983 and 84. Australian team member, most valuable player runner-up in 79 and one of the Bullets leading scorers in 85. Calvin Bruton, a player with a rare shooting touch. It's Bruton outside, he attempts a three-pointer. Oh yes! And don't the fans love that? Stuart Begg, 26 years of age, 203 centimetres, 90 kilos. Truck salesman, first year with the Brisbane Bullets. Stewart represented New South Wales in junior basketball with 115 games in the National Basketball League. Stewart will be adding to the powerful force of the Brisbane Bullets. John Dorge, 24 years of age, 208 centimetres, 101 kilos. A towering chicken farmer. Second year with the Bullets and 27 games in the NBL. Current member of the national squad, 1985 and 86. John Dorge, an up-and-coming champion. Leroy Loggins, 28 years of age, 197 centimetres, 74 kilos. A tour director, four years with the Brisbane Bullets and reputedly the best American to ever play in the National Basketball League. Leroy voted valuable player in 1984, played in two NBL title teams, 1983 West Adelaide and 1985 Brisbane. Leroy voted all-star in the NBL is one player who knows exactly what it takes to win an NBL title. Matthews, and Matthews winning that battle and sending Leroy Loggins away. Slam! Leroy Loggins. Danny Morso, 28 years of age, 195 centimetres, 92 kilos. A junior basketball development officer, another dual champion. Danny, having played two title games in 79 and 80 and voted All-Star 5, 1980 and 81. Danny Morso, with 132 games in the NBL, is to prove a powerful strength to the Brisbane Bullets in the years to come. Tom Gerhardt, 29 years of age, 200 centimetres, 99 kilos, school teacher. Another new member to the Bullets, but certainly no newcomer to league basketball. Tom having spent a four-year scholarship at the University of Illinois, AAU national champion in 79, and toured through Portugal with the AAU team and played for Lima, Peru in South America. Tom Gerhardt rejoins the Brisbane Bullets and the National Basketball League of Australia after an absence of three years. Ron Radcliffe, 28 years of age, 183 centimetres, 73 kilos. Barman. Ronnie's in his fourth year with the Bullets and 76 games in the NBL under his belt. Ron Radcliffe twice toured Australia with state all-star team from the USA. Led the Bullets in the three-point shooting throughout the last two seasons. Nicknamed Ronnie the Rat, a mop-haired American you can expect big things from in 86. Radcliffe with the shot from outside. Oh, yes, the three-pointer. Robert Sibley, 20 years of age, 198 centimetres, 93 kilos, a sales representative. Robert represented Australia under-20s in 1984 and represented Queensland five times as a junior. Robert Sibley. The youngest member of the Bullets, a sensation in recent years, and in 86, his prospects look even better.
Chris McGraw, 25 years of age, 198 centimetres, 100 kilos, a sporting goods salesman. In his sixth year with the Bullets and having ripped down 159 rebounds in 26 games to give a strong service on the boards and a score of 206 points, with that under his belt, Chris could find himself back in the green and gold which he wore in the 81 national tour throughout the USA and China. Chris McGraw making his mark in Australian basketball. The Brisbane Bullets, the champions from the Sunshine State. Tremendous season for the Brisbane skipper. There goes Carl Brisbane. <laughs> and Brian Curl shows his emotion. Behind the Bullets is a driving force. Coach Brian Curl. He's the former St Kilda Pumas coach and represented Australia in the 72 Munich Olympic Games. Brian Curl's expertise and experience drove the Bullets to win the NBL Finals in 85. Dave Nelson, assistant coach. His past experience will prove a real asset to the Bullets. Dave having spent five years as captain of the Canberra Cannons and won the NBL final in 83 and 84. Brian Curl and Dave Nelson. Their sights are set on the 1986 NBL championships and the years to come. Radliff back for Sandstock and he's put it away. With NBL games telecast on TVO from the Sleeman Sports Complex at Chandler, Australia's premier sporting stadium, members of the Brisbane Bullets are becoming household names. Carl Bruton and the Brisbane bench are stunning here. Major sponsors associated with the Brisbane Bullets for 1986 are Castle Main Perkins, Southern Comfort, City Mazda, Vince Hickey Basketball Supplies, TVO, Radio 4BC, FM 104, the Mayfair Crest International Hotel, the Commonwealth Bank of Australia, NEC, TAA, Compact Business Systems, Sperry Computers, Spalding Australia, Yellow Cabs, McDonnell and East, QUF, AUF, Leo Muller Toyota, Puma and Coca-Cola. With these major sponsors backing the Brisbane Bullets, they certainly will be the champions this season. They're all going down for the Brisbane Bullets, whatever they toss up. And now for the first time, Castle Main Perkins have commissioned Gary Smith and Idris Jones to produce the Brisbane Bullets new jingle. Brisbane Bullets, the champions from the Sunshine State.